Hey everybody, welcome to the tea table. Today we got a cool deck profile and gameplay of a deck that I wasn't really sure what to call. So we're just going Legendary Dog uh, Toolbox. So uh, your quote-unquote mana taggers here are going to be Entei V with the Fleet-Footed ability. Uh, once your turn attacks to draw a card and Burning Rondo 20 plus 20 for each bench and play both yours and your opponent. And Raikou, which does the same thing. Fleet Footed, Tax Dry Card, Lightning Rondo, 20 plus 20 for each bench Pokemon in play. So let us see what we play with it to make it a cool toolbox and do some neat stuff. So we're going to start with the two Crobat V when you play Drawn to F6. Pretty, pretty staple there. We got two Moltres from Pokemon Go. Your basic fire Pokemon's attacks, except Moltres, uh, do do 10 more to your opponent's active. So the card's like pretty cool. Um, to pump up your Entei, uh, via two of them, it's like another bench Pokemon in play. I've been able to pump out a lot of damage real quick with it. And as well, you can just use it to knock out a Milting if you have to, which is pretty sweet. We got the one Radiant Charizard, only one Radiant Pokemon in your deck, everybody. This attack costs one less for each prize card your opponent has taken. Combustion Blast for 250. Um, if they take a prize, it takes four, three, two, one, and etc, etc. You just can't use the next turn, but that's, that's really okay. Then we got the 1-0 Aura from Vivid Voltage. If your opponent's active is a V or GX, it does 80 more. Um, and as for your Tree Cots, which is really sweet, so if you start with it, it doesn't really matter. And uh, with the Choice Spell, you can knock out Palkia. Then we got 3 Mew from Celebrations, which is kind of what you want to start with, because you can look at the top 6 and take an item. It's a good pivoter starter for everything you are trying to do. Then we got the one Luminion V, beautiful art, so beautiful. When you play this card from your hand onto your bench, search for a supporter. Just helps you get set up, rebound, get going, whatever you need it to do. It's there. Let's check out the items. We got the two energy search because we do play lightning and fire energy. We got the two escape rope because it can help with your Charizard to attack again. If it doesn't get knocked out the first time. And also sometimes your opponent brings up fodder so they don't lose the game. And you're like, well, I'm on escape rope and you're going to lose the game anyway. We got the one, I'm sorry, one ordinary rod. Shove up to two Pokemon and or two basic energy from a disc ball in your deck. Pretty good because we got a couple one ofs. I did accidentally skip over a sweet and heavy ball. Look at your prizes. If there's a basic, trade it and then shuffle your prizes. We got the one pal pad to recycle your supporters. We got the four quick ball, discard a card, get a Pokemon, pretty staple in every deck. The two scoop up net to pick up your Mew, basically, if you have to. Um, I was going to put a Galarian Zigzagoon in here, but I did change it to drop it for now, but um, that is definitely a card you can return later. We got the four trekking shoes, look at the top card, you can put it in your hand. If you don't, discard it and draw a card. Then we got the one Ultra Ball, another way to get Pokemon. Now the trekking shoes is pretty cool because it combos with our stadium, Magma Basin, once during each player's turn, that player may attach a fire energy card from their discard ball to one of their bench fire Pokemon. If you do, put two damage cards on that Pokemon, which is not too bad. I'm um, talking like get you to do an Entei power up or Radiant Charizard if you need to do a crazy thing we want to do it in one turn. Definitely helps with that. And like I said, if you got to have Moltres too, whatever. Um, sometimes I'll use it. I'll just like put it on something um, just to have it there because I got to do a weird retreat later. And it's kind of one of those things. Move the supporters. We got two bosses or bring out this Pokemon. We got Kindler. I just love this card. <laughs> um, you can only use this card if you discard a fire. Look at the top seven. Put two of them in your hand and shuffle the rest. Helps fuel Magma Basin. And I just I just think that card's really cool. And any excuse kind of I can to play it, I am in. We got the one Clara. Choose one or both. It is like Ordinary Rod, but to your hand. So put two Pokemon for discard in your hand. Slash and or two basic energy. We got the one Marnie for Disruption. We got the four Professor Research to draw. We got the, the two Raihan here. Uh, if your Pokemon was knocked out last during your opponent's last turn, you can use this attach basic energy to Pokemon and search for a card. Then we got one Air Balloon, give you two less retreat to help with like that Moltres you might start with or something. Two Choice Spell to help against those Vs. We got the one Twin Energy. As long as this card is attached to Pokemon that is not a V, or a GX, it provides two colorless, so what you can do, let's say they knock out whatever, this Entei, right? Or this Raikou. If you got four prizes left, this card will take three energy. 
Um, you can Raihan and then search for Twin Energy, attach, and get attacking. Which is pretty sweet, cool combo, and I like it. Also, sometimes you're like, oh, gotta retreat them Ultras. Um, then we round it out with the 7 Fire and 2 Lightning. I thought about doing 3 Lightning, but I went with the 2 Energy Search over the 3 Lightning. So, with that being said, we're going to jump in to a few games and see if we can get some people with Legendary Dog Box. Alright, let's jump into two, maybe three games depending on how they go and see if we can get some people with our legendary dog. Sorry, Suicune. You're somewhere else. Alright, so it is... Uh, I'm excited. I love this deck. I build this deck in real life. It's super cool. You know, just one of those neat decks here. I did win the coin flip, so we will go first to get a bench going. Um, well, we mulligan. They're going to know we're playing Fire Pokemon. They also, I wonder if they're playing Fire Pokemon, as they have Charizard and Charizard. We did open Mew. Mewtwo. They're playing Mewtwo. All right. We're going to have to careful how we bench here, um, as they could do a lot of damage to us with Mewtwo's V-Star that does 120 to all Vs. So, but going first does help. Well, they gave us the Shock Face. Well, we're just going to give it back. We're just going to give it back. All right. What do they open here? Open Chansey. All right, let's see here. We will start off with Mysterious Tail. I don't know anything about my prizes. So we're just going to blind go into this. We're blind heavy balling. Nice. All right, so we've got Energy Surge, Raihan, and a Twin Energy Prize. Okay, okay. We will bench that. Uh, we can go the Riker route, I guess. We'll discard a Stadium. Well, we know Riker's in our deck, so. Um, we will get Raikou. We can save stuff for next turn, and we will pass. We don't need to go too crazy, as it is turn one. So. Can't attack. No need to go insane there. Alright, let's see what our opponent does. Whimsicott. Luckily, uh, our Twin Energy's priced. <laughs> So, that's not too bad. You know, we might need it. Research in... Whoa. Oh, getting rid of two suspicious Futin. That's good for us. That healing laner going to be... Whoo! I don't like that. And we win the game. I guess they do nothing. Ah, oh, we're so talented. Let's go! Alright, next game. Let's do it. Ah, uh, here we go, George the Zombie. Bring it on, George the Zombie. Sorry, my mom messaged me. <laughs> well, the thing. Mama. How you doing? I'm doing great, Mom. We're going to go first again. Well. Well. Not the start you want. That was fine. Wild. Huh. Okay. Uh, well, we're going to retreat. Draw a card with Fleet Footed. Nice. Uh, we will be conservative. I don't want to go too deep, but there's no point in not using this ability as you draw a card. So. Um, well, we could have, well, we got a lot of stuff prized. That's, that's all I'm going, I'm just going to say right now. We got a lot of stuff prized. So let's see what our opponent does here. I feel like they got a crowbat in their hand or something. Or they got another research or Martin. I don't know. They did discard research. No, they're just passing. Okay. Okay. Um, we'll start off with the fleet footing. Okay, okay. Um, I would like to put that card in my hand. Thank you very much. <laughs> I would like to draw seven cards. Isn't that wild? Man. Well, we're just going to Burning Rondo for 150. 
Well. Well. <laughs> Stuff do be happening, I guess. I mean, we get the draw and the ability on Entei, probably. All right. They need to miss both an energy and the stadium. <laughs> All right, here. So, benching these Crobats. Uh, so, bleh. Right? So, bleh. We're doing 170. Well, that's good for us. Right? Because that means they're not attacking our into this turn. And I'm definitely going to target it, I think, to try and get it out of there. Okay. Uh, well, we'll draw... Uh, Raikou? I mean, our hand's like fine, right? I mean, we got to hit them. So 40, 60, 80, 120. I mean, we're two shotting. Our opponent hit me with the well played. Okay. I, I don't know what you want me to do. My hand is very bad. <laughs> so. I don't know if they choice belt knock this out. That is fine, right? Yeah. Because that means they can't meta jam this. Which is really cool, I think. Marnie. Blech. All right. Well, most of our base Pokemon have gone to the bottom of our deck. So hopefully. Well, oddly enough, that lets us get a knock. So. Nice. We really could just be attacking the active, even though I've, that feels kind of bad. But who knows? Yep. Ah, they might just attack with that. Okay, okay. Well, they're just going to get both? They will, in fact, knock out the bench. Okay, so they're just going to attack us with this, I guess. Which doesn't kill me. 40, 60, 80, 100. So, oddly enough, this lets us kill. So, it's really funny. Uh, we, <laughs> uh, we're gonna draw a card first. Nice. We'll do this. Okay, so, we're doing 40, 60, 80, 100, 120, 140. Right. So, we do this. 40, 60, 80, 120. Uh, we'll do this. I mean, we'll attach here. We'll get the knockout. And I, I need that one quick ball. Nice. Alright, our last three prizes are Magma Basin. I love that for someone. Alright, so they could do 20, I mean, if they got, like, some insane attack, or, like, they do freaking, uh, Mentaleon, Zigzagoon, Zigzagoon, like, whatever, right? You got me. So. We, uh, haven't had much choice this game in doing things, realistically, um, because of our start. And in fact, our last three prizes are, in fact, Magma Basin. Okay, they will get shady dealings here. They can't knock us out with a Raihan and the Stadium Retreat. So, we will see what they do. See, assuming they're gonna get stadium. Nope, or just search. Just search for food.
And their hand is 11 cards. It's pretty crazy. And there's no way they get attacked with this, right? Because we'll just kill them. <laughs> so, they will Melanie. Get that stadium for free retreat cost. I mean, they're not going to do anything to us this turn, so that's really good. Oh my god, I have to pick that off now, right? Escape rope. Let's do 150, huh? They will, in fact, go for the knockout. Ah, right, here, we'll do this. Let's see here. I, mean, I got so many things in here. We got, I mean, we do have the one Barney as well. Which I think I'm going to do. Thanks, opponent. I just do five support, four supporters, bro. Wild. Well, we're dead. Game is over. Yep, 40, 60, 80. We are 30 short. We are dead. Well, I guess we don't scoop on the channel, so. Our opponent said it was with well played turn two, to be fair. They did say we lost turn two, so. They knew what was happening. It'd be like that. It's okay. Because they can just do this and then do this next turn. So, it is what it is. We will be dead next turn. Um, they can also just hit us with this, which is like really super funny. Kind of a thing. A good meme, if you will. As we do have no way to attack with that card. So, uh, we will be dying. Unfortunately. Oh, wait, we win. I'm dumb. That's three prizes. Ignore all those words I just said. <laughs> that last two minutes where I thought I lost the game. I promise I'm paying attention. <laughs> Woo! Sorry about that, everybody. I... Burning farted, thinking for some reason that wasn't three prizes. Anyway, um, that's two games. Let's see if we can get third game in here. Because that first one was, they scooped. Alright, here we go. I was like, damn, our opponent's saying, I beat you. I'm like, yeah, you're right. They, they almost, like, inadvertently got me to concede. All right, we got a we got a Mew going on here. That's a good start. Almost out to start that Crobat. We'll see what our opponent's playing. Jolteon. All right, all right. Well, something. Okay. We're going with this. I would like an energy right now. Any energy, any... Oh my god. Well. Well. Maybe we'll draw fire. Because then we could... 
That's fine. Haha, <laughs> joke's on you. Damn, joke's on me. Can't believe I did last game. I'm sorry, everybody. Might be a little tired. <laughs> we lost. Just kidding. That's three prizes. <sighs> Good me, me. Okay. I mean... Missing that energy really sucked. Because then we just kill them. You know? They will search for another Jolteon. With Featherball. Oh, they're getting the VMAX. Thinking, thinking. They will quick ball. But now, now I'll get a jolt down. Sobble. Alright, their hand is a VMAX. Okay. Well, we're going to discard this to get this Moltres. I guess. I would love to put that card into my hand. Okay, only prize one this time. Uh, we will attach this because we're drawing Magma Basin. Let's go. Right now we're doing 40, 60, 80, 120, 40, 60, 70. Um, sure. No. 40, 60, 80, 120, 40, 60, 70. We're pretty talented. I will draw a card Fleet Footin'. And I will Burning Rana for 220 damage. Let's go. Hey, it's our only Magma Basin prize. Opponent scoops. They're like, it doesn't matter if I draw Drizzle. We are behind. So, hey, we've got a three-game win streak. Pretty cool. All right, so uh, we're going to open these up while I talk about the deck real quick. In one second after this very slow animation happens. Wrong button. All right, so the deck is really cool. Um, I just, like, it feels powerful. And then I haven't explored it enough with, like, a lot of things. But I think your recoverability, uh, if you don't price three Magma Basins, we still did win, even though I thought we lost. Really good. Uh, we need better Lightning Pokemon. That's really what that taught me. Nice. Um, like, Pokemon, uh, we had Picarom and Thunder Mountain and Tapu Koko Prism, and they said, all your Lightning Pokemon are now very average. Unfortunately... But the Zero Aura and Raikou um, have been really good when I've needed them. Like that game, I know I had the two Mews, but I could just use Raikou to pivot because I did have Raihan in my hand. So I think that's really cool. Magma Basin, great card. I remember that came out. I was like, that's insane. I remember I first tested and I was like, wow, it's only on your bench. They really said, these aren't, no, no, that's not, that's not. It's really why, like, they, you know, they said, we can't, we remember Welder and everything. So, um, one of those things, but I love fire. If you saw my Santa Scorch Charizard video, you know that for sure. Nice. Um, with that being said, the deck is really sick. Uh, it's a deck I want people to explore more. Hopefully, someone watching this will be like, you know what, Josh? I trust you. That's a cool idea. So, with that being said, we just hit 10,000 views on the channel. Appreciate that. We are on the way to 200 subscribers. I don't know if I'm going to do a special thing or whatever. Maybe I'll do a deck wizard video. You know, one of those things. Um, drop a like. Leave a comment what you thought. Except for that game where I thought I lost. That I won. Don't ever scoop, kids. That was just a lesson. Just me messing with you. <laughs> um, follow me on Twitter. Hit up the Twitter if you want those sick deck lists I always post. I'm Josh Shatter. This is the Tea Table. That's a bunch of legendary dogs. And I will see you next time.